on the mountaintop. Mountaintop experiences prepare us for the valleys of everyday life. Mark 9, 2-5 After six days, Jesus took Peter, James, and John with him and led them up a high mountain where they were alone. There he was transfigured before them. His clothes became dazzling white, whiter than anyone in the world could bleach them. And there appeared before them Elijah and Moses, who were talking with Jesus. Peter said to Jesus, Rabbi, it is good for us to be here. Let us put up three shelters, one for you, one for Moses, and one for Elijah. I have some beautiful pictures to show you of this morning. They are pictures taken of some of the most beautiful mountain peaks you can imagine. Have you ever taken a vacation in the mountains? Of all the vacations that I have ever taken, the ones that I enjoyed the most were the ones that I took in the mountains. Did you know that even Jesus enjoyed getting away for a mountain retreat? The Bible tells us that one day Jesus took Peter, James, and John high up into the mountains so that they could be alone. While on the mountaintop, Jesus' appearance was changed. His clothes became dazzling white. Then the disciples saw Moses and Elijah talking to Jesus. Peter became so excited that he told Jesus that they thought they should just stay up on the mountain. Did Jesus and the disciples stay up on the mountain? No. Jesus knew that the purpose of their experience on the mountaintop was to renew their strength for the difficult days that were ahead of them. So he led the disciples back down into the valley. You and I sometimes need a vacation in the mountains to help us cope with the heat and stress of our everyday life. We also need mountaintop experiences in our daily walk with Jesus. We need those experiences to renew our strength for the difficult tasks that we may face as we follow Jesus each day. Dear Jesus, we are thankful for the wonderful mountaintop experiences you give us to renew our strength for our daily walk with you. Amen.